guys got another video here for you this one's on diagnosing USB issues now we're going to be uh, cleaning up some old USB uh, storage drivers and stuff like that from the system now, everything uses USB nowadays is uh, external hard drives portable flash memory devices digital cameras digital audio uh, devices like iPods card readers you name it the list goes on and on and these can uh, install drivers on the system and they could just be left there and they can cause a lot of confliction and confusion to Windows which causes a lot of problems so what we're going to do is go through some steps here uh, and fix some of these issues now the first thing I want to do is uh, right click on my computer here and go properties and uh, once we get there I'm going to go to device manager now the thing with device manager it'll only show uh, devices inside here that are plugged into the actual system at the time and that's not what we want to do we want to see the hidden stuff now you may be thinking you can just go up to view and show hidden devices which is uh, going to be showing you hidden devices but it doesn't show you uh, drivers that are on the system that aren't in use and this is what we need to do to remove these drivers that may be causing a confliction uh, when you're using a USB device so what we're going to do is make a couple of little uh, tweaks to the system and then we're going to use a driver cleanup tool to remove all the USB drivers so let's get started so the first thing I want to do down here is go to the advanced uh, system settings and once I've got that open you'll see this little box in the advanced uh, tab up the top here called in uh, environment variables click on that now there's two areas here there's the user and there's the system variables we're going to be using the system variables here because that will let everyone uh, use this uh, tweak here so we're going to go to new and the first thing you want to do is put this command in there I'm going to paste that in for quickness and then we want to put a 1 in there and click OK and you'll see it there and then we're going to click OK and click OK again now if we go back to uh, device manager here and then go to show hidden uh, devices you can now see uh, some greyed out uh, devices that will be shown inside here by using that little command and as you can see there's a lot of USB stuff here okay now I haven't used that in a long time and this and you may have loads and loads of these and all these gray ones uh, can basically be removed now obviously going through this manually uh, will take some time uh, so I'm going to show you a method that you can use to remove all these from the system in one fell swoop okay so let's close this off okay so what we want to do here is we need to pull out all our USB devices now obviously you can't pull out your keyboard and your mouse you're going to need your keyboard and mouse but you should start pulling out all your other devices ie uh, webcams or anything like that microphones any sort of USB device that's plugged into the system and then shut the system down and reboot the system now once we've rebooted the system what we're going to do is we're going to run a driver cleaning tool and the driving cleaning tool is here on my desktop I will put the link in the description and as you can see here uh, there's a 64-bit version which is the version I'm using and a 32-bit version okay so you select which version you want and I will put the link in there so you can download this tool now what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click and copy this now I'm not going to be pulling out any of my USB uh, devices because I'm obviously doing this video okay so I want to copy and put this into my C Windows system 32 and I'm going to paste this into here okay I'm just going to get a little space on the edge here and paste that in there and there it is there okay drive cleanup exe that's all we need to type out so what we need to do now is come down to the rum or start bar and then type CMD and then I want to right click on this and then run as administrator just uh, pull this over here now once we've done that we're going to be typing in there uh, drive cleanup exe like that 
and then we're going to run that. Okay, so we're going to let that run on through, and that's going to remove all those devices. Now you may see loads more than this, and as you can see, it's removed quite a lot from the system. Now these can build up over time, as I said, this is pretty much a fresh install, um, so there isn't much on the system. And uh, once that's done, we're pretty much good to go. Now you can remove this uh, from the system if you want to, after you've finished. So we can go back to Windows, System32, and you can come down to find your the actual uh, driver cleanup tool. Okay, so we've got our driver cleanup tool now. We can delete this. We don't need this anymore. You can leave it there. It's not going to harm the computer in any way, shape, or form. But if you fancy deleting it and you don't want it in there, you can delete it afterwards. And that should sort a lot of your issues out. Okay, so I hope this has been useful for you. My name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, please remember, guys, hit that subscribe button and show your support. Also, rate and favorite all my videos if you enjoy them. And I'll be making more useful videos uh, for you in the future. So, thanks again for watching, guys. Thanks for your support. Bye for now.